Hi Aries, it's Elle here to do your oracle reading for this week. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It is much appreciated. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and jump into this Aries. Thank you Lord God for blessing Aries with a clear, concise message from you. So Aries, your energy is fair male. Okay. And... Uh, new love okay so this fair male could be significant to the reading um you're dealing with someone with fair skin could be european descent um maybe light brown hair or lightish brown hair reddish hair i don't know anyhow um this male is significant to the reading um this could be a new love or a new lease on life or just a new found love for yourself also you could be the fair male um Aries, if you're an Aries male, come into the reading. Um, if not, this new love could be with this person, whether they've already come in or they are coming. It looks like your person, um, Aries, is uh, going through karma, okay? Uh, maybe uh, in their work or with work. And they're feeling very much uh, control. Or, or under some control here. They have to control themselves. Your person can feel like the relationship between the two of you is karmic. Not toxic. Karmic doesn't always equal toxic. But karmic equals is for a higher purpose. It, it, a lesson needs to be learned. Something you, you were destined to meet. So the lesson could then start. And hopefully you learn it. You learn from it and you move on. Your person uh, could be also in a karmic relationship outside of you now. Um, you could have met this person at work or doing work. Also, your person could feel like this relationship is a lot of work, okay? Um, or the relationship they're in is a lot of work. It's going to take a lot of work to either repair uh, the relationship with you or vice versa, the one that they're already in. They have to maintain control in dealing with you or vice versa. This is what you have to do. Um, somebody is being controlled in order to have or be in order to see or to do or to have privileges so um, I don't know if some there's like a someone's being very controlling they're the puppeteer uh, here they have the control it's almost as if someone's holding something over the other person I don't know what it could be it could be anything so there is the element of control your person also is trying to control themselves at work. Um, maybe they, they took up a workplace uh, romance relationship. So they're trying to control themselves. Um, they're taking their power back and they're not being so loose and free with, you know, themselves, I guess. Um, the cards want you to listen to your intuition, Aries, above all. You can't listen to your intuition if you're listening to 30 tarot card reading today if you're listening to friends family countrymen romans i don't know everybody okay you got to listen to your intuition in that quiet space in that quiet place because it will give you some gems in terms of what it is you need to do next how you need to move also listening to your intuition getting to a place of meditation it uh it soothes the spirit the anxiety the frustration the confusion so, um, it says that you already know what you need to do or what's going on. You just need to listen to it. You, you might also be pushing something down, repressing some information or some feeling. How you feel, Aries, right now is um, pathway. You may be on a new pathway. You're not concerned about this person, place, or thing. You, you're, you have started something new, something over, um... You're, or you're making yourself over or just doing something new. You also could be uh, dating other people. Okay? Um, and because you started something new here with this pathway card. And because maybe you have a new love or just a new lease on life. Uh, a renewed sense of self. Um, it's making you highly attractive to... Uh, maybe this person that you kind of withdrew your energy from. This person is operating in regret and remorse, wanting to come to you, waiting for 
the opportunity to come to you, waiting for you to respond to them or reach out to them, waiting for communication. But you just feel like it's manipulative behavior. It's manipulative because circumstances are moving this person to do. Not this person wanting or needing to do. The circumstances, circumstances of you not being there, you withdrawing your energy, you taking back your energy, all of this stuff is making them now want to come to you. You feel like they're very manipulative. Also, they have manipulative behaviors about themselves. Or this is what you're doing. You're withdrawing so that you can draw the person in. So you are being manipulative. However it works. Your person right now is showing up as a um, courthouse. Needing to get little nuances, paperwork, documents you know officiated signed I don't know if they're going to meet you at the courthouse or they met you at the courthouse or you met them at the courthouse I don't know um, or maybe they this is how they reach out to you because they want to get something done get some work done or they need your help they need business matters they need help with your um, with business matters you might see this person at a bank or around a bank or something about business matters um, running errands in, in terms of paperwork and business okay your person also may need to do this, they, and, and this is what they're finding to be hard to do. They may need to go file paperwork in terms of their relationship or marriage or whatever they're in because they are showing up as a ten of cups. So they could have a family, they could be married, they could be happy to an extent. Um, it's not real though, something is not realized. I don't know what that's about. I don't know if the person is not married to this the person they're with, but they have children or family that they live together, but now they're going to go get something of officiated or their separation or divorce or separation of assets, separation of the kids, a divorce decree, alimony, child support. I don't know. Your person is saying, yeah, you know, maybe I am a player, an F boy, F girl, you know, or this is who I am dealing with right now. And, what, and that's why it's hard work. And it's coming up as karmic because I need to learn the lesson of, you know, dealing with these type of people or choosing these type of people because um, now I am under their control because um, I have obligation to them. The cards want you to know that whatever it is you're trying to do, it's just not the right time. It's not ever, but it's just not the right time. This person could want to court you, date you exclusively, or want to be in a relationship with you. This could be someone who gets around the town or their name rings bells around the town. They have a good reputation, a businessman, businesswoman. Mm -hmm. Expect the unexpected, expect unexpected money or expect an unexpected message from this person, okay? Out of the blue, this person shows back up for you, okay? Because they want to rectify their relationship. This person feels like you are the good Samaritan. In their heart, in their life, with you there is balance, there is harmony. They could want to change a journey with you. With you they see wish fulfillment, happiness. You are seductive, sexy. They could want to marry you. And then before they divorce, either a way of being, existing, a lifestyle, or an actual person. So this person can't do anything until something is offic officiated. Is that the word? Or is official? Something and that don't, can be saying it wrong. It just keeps coming up. Okay. So um, this is your reading, Aries. I hope that it resonated for you. If it did, go over to the website, book your own reading, just like this oracle reading. Um, they're now on sale, and it will be linked below also to get your own oracle reading. You can also ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. You can also donate to the channel. If you feel like you took something from the reading, you can always give back by buying me a coffee. Yep, the link is below. It says buy me a coffee. Thank you, Aries. Many blessings to you. Take care.